So the morning starts with Sabres, S-A-V-E-R-S, silence, affirmation, vision, exercise, reading, and scribing. It's very simple. One hour is going to give you 10 minutes for each one of those. Silence is very important, guys. Silence is meditation. More importantly, silence is letting the universe talk to you instead of you talk to the universe. Anybody here got a mind that's going constantly talking to you? That's you talking to your brain, you talking to your mind, you talking to the universe, and most of it, 98% of it is useless, negative, destructive chat. If you're anything like me, your brain's not whispering sweet nothings in your ear. If you're anything like me, you're waking up in the morning and your brain's going, oh good, I'm glad you're awake. I've been wanting to talk to you. Remember that thing your boss talked to you about yesterday? That's gonna be the end of your career. Oh, remember that guy that uh, set the appointment yesterday? He's not gonna show up. Blah, 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 blah. Oh, by the way, that bump on your knee? Yeah, that's bone cancer. You're gonna be dead in a year. Why the hell are you getting out of bed? <laughs> if your mind talks to you like that, then you relate to me. That's how mind talks to me. We're gonna get into some silence, some meditation, do some breathing exercises. And on the count of five, hold it for five, breathe out for the count of five. During that silence, you're just trying to get your brain to shut the F up. Shut up. You're trying to get your mind to stop talking to you. If you can have 10 minutes a day where your brain isn't talking to you, that's gonna open up your mind so that the universe can be talking to you. Once you get used to that, you're gonna want a lot more than 10 minutes of it. Next comes A, affirmation. I have my affirmations. I am a world-class sales leader. I am the leader of a legendary sales force. My affirmations used to be, I'm a legendary salesperson. I'm a leader, I'm a sales leader in my industry. Those things are true now. I don't need affirmations. Those are statements of fact about the present. An affirmation is a statement of fact about the future. So today my affirmation is, I am a legendary sales leader. I'm the leader of a legendary sales movement. Those are statements of fact about the future. So I'm gonna spend about 10 minutes really making those statements, silence affirmation, then comes V, it's vision. And visions aren't goals, guys, they're actually being able to see. You're gonna see yourself and what you look like and where you live. This has a lot to do with Napoleon's Hill. If you can see it, if you can conceive of it, then you can believe it. If you cannot see it, you cannot believe in it. If you can't believe in it, you're never going to achieve it. All of these things interwind, right? And it all starts with reading two pages a day of each of many habits first, then Think and Grow Rich, and then Miracle Morning. These are real books that really work. These are iconic books. This is not Michael O'Donnell telling you these will make a difference in your life. These are things that are tried true. Everybody knows this. <laughs> Everyone you ever meet who's successful in business will tell you about these same books. Read two pages a day of these books. Treat them like a basic text. Start incorporating them. And that's part of Savers. So you got your vision. You can see it. And then you've got your exercise. It's one push-up. Turns into 10 push-ups. If you read Stephen Guy's book, Elastic Habits, you'll find lots of ways to create options for exercise, to create options for all of your mini habits. Turn them from mini habits to a plus habit to an elite habit. And that's Stephen Geiser's book, Elastic Habits. I read that book down the road and it completely expanded my ability to turn these habits into behaviors on steroids. That is the key. So you go through your silence, affirmation, vision, exercise, reading, two pages a day. Which one of these books are you reading two pages a day? Guys, I'm telling you, when you finish a book that's iconic, a book that's proven to make a difference, it's going to make a difference. How are you going to do that? By reading two pages a day. So the last one is scribe. I wrote the book no matter what, by having a habit of literally sitting down and writing one sentence a day. And of course, I hardly ever wrote one sentence. I would normally end up scribbling out for a good 10 minutes. I would get out what happened yesterday, what I want to get out today. That one sentence, guys, can literally be the sentence. I'm supposed to write one sentence. Here's your damn sentence. If that's your one sentence, that's it. So silence, affirmation, vision, exercise, reading, and scribing. Scribing means writing. You can get that done in one hour. You will figure out by working with me on the calls and by structuring your day how you're going to make magic. And this magic is actual momentum. Once you find momentum, 
you just become unstoppable.